in, like coming out, you know, taste the rainbow. Um, <laughs> you know, coming out like to my mother was really, really hard. Like I thought it would be easy. Um, because my mother does like makeup. So you know like most makeup ladies and clothing ladies and people who do like interior interior design, they're supposed to like like gay people. And like when I came out to her, she was like, not in my house. <laughs> you know, she was frying my chicken and anointing all and <laughs> Cause seriously, like, 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 when you, like, it's like my white friends, like, cause they, and Wayne, you inspired me too. Yes, you did. You was like, you better tell him over that shit. Um, no, like, and so, like, it was like really, really, like, <laughs> it was like really, really, you know, it was, it was interesting trying to come out, you know, because like my, I saw my white friends come out, and you know, they came out, you know, and they was like throwing parties, and and their parents was like paying their scholarships and stuff like that. In a black family, you come out, they taking your ass to church. That was just plain as something. <laughs> you know. <laughs> it was just lots and lots of church. Like every day, seven days a week. You know, we bind that spirit of homosexuality. And I was like, yes, bind that spirit. <laughs> <laughs> So that was like crazy. And this shit came out again. <laughs> Sick of this shit. Yeah. I don't know, but it was like really, really crazy coming out. Okay, so like when I first came out to my mother, like it was crazy because like my mother, like she is like a spiritual woman, like she believes in God. And so it's like, you know, as far as she been taught, like, you know, being gay was, you know, bad. And then of course, being from the South, you know, of course, you don't be no sissy. So, you know, like it, it was crazy because my mother is like my mother slash like, like personal evangelist, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so like I go to her to reach God, you know what I'm saying? Like God sits on the bed and talks to her every morning, you know? <laughs> I'd be like, what'd he look like? She'd be like, he got cornrows. <laughs> 